this is the Iveco Stralis natural power 4B2 tractor unit. So you get out of the vehicle, move the air deflector out of your way, reveals the small box. Open the door on the box. The connector has the black rubber uh, bung on the end. Take the rubber bung off. At that point, go to the connector, remove it from the pump and attach the connector to the vehicle. As you pick up the connector, the arrows will be pointing towards each other. You move the handle through 180 degrees, both arrows will be pointing in the same direction towards the vehicle. At this point, you should feel that the connector is solid on the uh, vehicle itself. Then go to the authorization point with the fob, offer up the fob, it will ask you for the uh, registration number and odometer details, put those details in and it will tell you to fill at the pump number which you've connected to. At that point, go back to the pump, turn the switch to start, and the traffic light above the pump will go from green to solid red. At this point, the vehicle will then start to fill. There's nothing more to then do until the vehicle has finished filling, which will happen automatically. Once the vehicle is full, the solid red light will become a flashing red light. At this point, return to the pump and flick the switch from start back to stop. Then return to the vehicle, undo the connector, going back 380 degrees to where you started. This will release the connector from the vehicle. Hang the connector back on the pump, then return to the vehicle, put the rubber bung on the connector and close the door where the pump connector is. It is important that you close the door on the connector as there is a micro switch on that door which will mean the vehicle will not start if the door is not closed to make sure that nobody pulls away with pumps still connected. Put the air dam back in place, return to the vehicle and drive away.